It's the Braves and the Brewers opening day in Milwaukee as the fans coming through the turnstiles heading into Miller Park. And it's the return of Ryan Braun after serving a 65-game suspension at the end of the 2013 season. Braun's first at-bat in the bottom of the first, and he gets the warm standing ovation from the capacity crowd at Miller Park, facing Julio Tehran, and Braun gets underneath this one. He flies out to left field in his first at-bat of the season. On the mound for Milwaukee, Giovanni Gallardo, his fifth consecutive opening day start. In the top of the second with one on and one away, down goes Evan Gaddis. And then in the third, B.J. Upton, see ya, as Gallardo keeps it a scoreless game. Now let's go to the bottom of the fourth. It is Braun back at the plate with a man on, and Braun sends this one into left field. Gene Segura goes first to third, and the Brewers have runners on the corners against Tehran in the fourth. Next batter for the Brewers, Aramis Ramirez, and on the pitch, Braun takes off for second base. He is in there with the stolen base, so the Brewers now with two runners in scoring position as Tehran in trouble, and Ramirez wants to make the youngster pay. Segura led the inning off of the walk. He's at third, Braun at second, Ramirez down the line. That is a fair ball! Two to all it goes! Segura is in, here comes Braun, and Aramis Ramirez puts the Brewers on top. It is a 2-0 lead for Milwaukee, but as we go to the fifth, Gallardo in some trouble. A first and second, two out jam, but B.J. Upton strikes out. Gallardo puts out the fire. He would go six scoreless innings on Monday. Bottom six we go. Tehran facing Braun again as he sends this one down to third. Chris Johnson fires across, but Braun is called safe. That raises the ire of Braves manager Freddie Gonzalez. The umpires check it out on the replay review, and this is the angle they use to make their determination of the proper call, and pretty clear from that angle that Braun was out by plenty, and so the play is overturned. Braun is called out, and the Brewers would not score in the sixth. To the seventh we go. Brandon Kitzler facing Braves shortstop Angleson Simmons. He was taken around with a changeup in spring training, but don't expect him to use too many of those. Oh, what a play by Ramirez to the first in time! Wow! Aramis Ramirez not only takes a double away, but turns it into an out. Aramis robbed us, says the Braves. What a play by the Brewers' third baseman. Top nine we go. Braves have the tying run at the plate in the form of Evan Gaddis as Francisco Rodriguez trying to slam the door. Gaddis the swing and a miss. That is how this one ends. K-Rod gets it done and no cacti anywhere in sight. That's a relief for him. Brewers pick up the 2-0 win as Ryan Braun finishes 1-4 for four with a stolen base in his return to action. Julio Tehran gives up two runs over six innings in his first career opening day start, but he takes the loss. Giovanni Gallardo, meantime, took over sole possession of second place in Brewers history in strikeouts, now trailing only Ben Sheets. The teams were 1-15 for 15 combined with runners in scoring position.